But yeah, that's about it for now. I'm gonna try to put out one video next week again. So I'll see you there. So it's been a while. You got the first packages. It's been some time since we last chatted, so let me fill you up on all the stuff that happened so far. The first thing we did before really starting to build out the van is we went to weigh it in. That right there is what they use to weigh in your van. It weighs about 2,100 kilograms. In the end, the van is allowed to only have 3,500 kilograms. So we have to be very careful to not go over that while we are building it out. The next thing we did was sound insulation. For this, we use this material called alubutyl, I think, alubutyl, I don't know how to pronounce it. It's essentially a material that takes the vibration out of the thin aluminium walls of the van and thus it kills the sound while, for example, driving the van. The material is very easy to handle. Um, you can just cut it with like scissors. It has like a sticky side to it, so you can just put it onto the wall and um, press it with some kind of like painting roll um, so that it becomes entirely flat. It only works when you really press it against the wall. This actually worked a lot better than I thought it would. Um, I did a little before and after. Sounds a lot better actually. Okay, let's chat about how we did the subfloor and the floor insulation. Insulation day. For the floor, we use a material called Armorflex. It has like a very good R value, so it's very good for heat isolation. Before we did anything, we cut the big wooden board that came with the van in two. That just makes our life a lot easier when we put it in and out of the van. Okay, so we went and got this like three meter long wood latches. First we put the latches in the van just to measure and see how we wanted to do it. We had to cut and measure all of these latches. I let my dad do the cutting because um, he's a cool guy. I just wanted to get him a little bit of work, you know? Yeah, meanwhile, I did all the fun stuff, um, like cleaning. <laughs> cleaning is very important, because this Armorflex has like a sticky side to it. The surface has to be very clean, otherwise it's not gonna stick. Once we were done with wood cutting, uh, we put it into the van and we glued it down with this super tight construction ceiling. It's called Sika Flex. Once the wood structure was in, we put the insulation in between the latches. In order to do that, we took uh, kitchen knives and we just cut the insulation along the wood. We didn't really bother measuring anything. It didn't really become beautiful, I'd say. But it's not meant to be beautiful. It's just meant to keep the heat in and the cold out. You're not going to see it later anyways. When the insulation was in, we put the wood floor in the van again. We had to cut a little bit off the sides of it to make it fit. But in the end it fitted. It's not the most aesthetic, 
but it fits. So the last thing I did was treat all the metal in the entire van. You have to be very careful with rust. And in order to prevent all of this rust, you have to treat it and then afterwards cover it uh, with paint again. I use a special three-in-one treatment uh, that treats and covers it at the same time. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Before I head out, I want to thank all of the guys that reached out after the last video. Um, the support has been amazing after the first episode. Uh, and I was really, really surprised that so many people liked it. Um, so that was a nice surprise. Thank you for that. If you want to support this clumsy project of mine... Um, like and subscribe. It really helps a lot. I'm probably the only guy in Luxembourg that's dumb enough to spend his entire student loan on a project like this. So, but yeah. See you next week, I guess. Okay, bye. It's gotta be against the law. Look this damn good. The baby, I feel real good and I wish I would. It's gotta be against the law. Look this damn good, baby. Watch out now. Everybody watch out. Watch out now. Everybody watch out. Watch out now. Watch out.